Hey pros, Crystal here from Crystal W Online and Elite Hair Care USA. So you guys know it's the holiday season and I just wanted to show you guys the different decorations that we did this year. So this is our Christmas tree. As you guys know from last year, we're using the same tree, you guys. This tree will probably be with us for about the next five to 10 years. And yes, it turns on a automatic turntable um, that we got from Hobby Lobby for about $20. So this year's colors are silver, white, and a hint of blue. And then of course our in-house family tree. This is a tree where we put like our sports stuff and all of our little ornaments. This is our also our Bucks tree. We're Bucks fans. Go Tampa Bay. Okay, yeah. Um, but we went ahead and put that tree in the corridor of the kids' rooms. So we have both trees up. This tree, we didn't really change really much. All we did was add more ornaments to it, like our favorite things, baseball, football, ballerinas. Um, this actual ornament is celebrating its 10th year. This was made by Alex back in 2013. For those of you that don't know, Alex's birthday is 32709. So she made this when she was four years old. She is now 14 years old. And yes, we held on to it. Now our banister is not complete, but we did start putting some of the stuff on there. And then I repurposed our centerpiece from last year that you guys saw me making at the table and I sprayed it silver. Um, this centerpiece will probably be repurposed about 20 more times. As long as there's spray paint and my two hands, it will be sprayed. And then for our mantle, we took the same mantle piece that we had from last year and just bought a couple of inserts from Hobby Lobby. So everything came from Hobby Lobby this year, you guys. They have the best prices. And then I just kind of inserted different colors um, to really just bring everything to life. Like nothing super fancy. These were actually 50% off, so they came to about 79 cents um, when I purchased them. And then just kind of added the bow for the silver effect. And then I still have to do the front door, which you guys won't really see that one, but we have two wreaths for the front door that I'm gonna add some silver to and some blue ribbon as well. Now, majority of the work for this year's Christmas decor actually went to the dining table and the Christmas tree. The reason I said the dining table is because I decided to make the centerpiece again. I enjoy doing things like this, you guys. So if you don't know, I've been Martha Stewart since I was little. I like to see things come together. I like to make things. And I'm also nice and frugal, so I like to make things that I know might cost me a ton of money if I didn't make it. So I'm one of those people where I always try to figure it out. Anyhow... Um, like I said, all of this stuff came from Hobby Lobby, except for the glue, which I had that already, um, and the glue gun. And then we are changing the table to um, really suit the holiday season. So the table is going to be white, silver, and gold um, with some hints of gold to it. And the stones and stuff, I just kind of added around so I could hide the bouquet and then I just used the same ribbon that we're using on the tree and repurposed it to cover um, the top part of the vase because I didn't have enough stones to cover up there. So while you guys are watching me finish the table vase or the centerpiece, I just wanted to let you guys know that today starts our stocking stuffer sale where we have our scalp care products that includes all of our serums and also our styling products are all $12 or less. So if you go to EliteHairCareUSA.com, you're able to shop that sale. That sale includes our Goddess Polish. It includes our Soothe and Balance. It includes all of the serums, amongst other products. And then, of course, I just wanted to let you guys know about our La Pure gift sets. These are limited edition gift sets that contain two products that we actually don't even carry on the site just yet. So the gift sets come with a full-size um, La Pure Super Scent, as well as an 8-ounce um, shower gel matching fragrance and also a eight ounce excuse me a four ounce body lotion matching fragrance and then they come in a cute gold sachet bag with a drawstring and a to and from sticker for you to be able to easily gift them to your friends and family so you guys go to crystalwonline.com and you'll be able to shop those different items now, what you guys saw me just do is uh, the candlesticks did not want to hold in the candlestick holder. So I just used a little bit of hot glue to kind of hold them in. 
These are really not for burning, you guys. It's more just for a part of the decor aesthetic, which is the reason why I did that. But the good thing is candle wax actually does not hold with hot glue. It will kind of just nestle it in place. And then I'll be able to reuse these candle holders as many times as I like. And they will be able to follow me through the next couple years. I like to buy things that I can use over and over again rather than things that I have to throw away all the time. Now, these are two different heights. So I think that height makes a lot of a difference when you're trying to do decor. It doesn't matter what table, what mantle, wherever it is. Heights are always really nice because it gives the eye the ability to move up and down and not focus in one place. Height also gives the aesthetic of a larger room or a taller room. And even though we have what you call vaulted ceilings, you still want to be able to draw the height in the room from the table. So you don't want the table to feel short in a sense. Now, I got this super cute fur runner um, from Hobby Lobby. And in my mind, I thought that it was absolutely long enough for our table <laughs> to only find out that it was not. So I quickly found out at this point while I was pulling it out and I'm like, okay, this is not going to work. So I had to kind of do some quick constructive criticism or constructive criticism, con quick critical thinking. Oh my gosh, my tongue is tied. And I said, well, you know what? I'm just going to make it shorter and then I can focus the centerpiece right in the middle of it and just kind of bring everything together. So I was not going to go and run out and try to do anything else. I was destined to make sure that this worked. Um, and I didn't want to spend any more money. So that was another reason why. Um, so I went ahead and started with my centerpiece, which was the vase with the rocks. And then I also got these placemats at Hobby Lobby. So the table colors is white, gold, silver, and then little hints of blue here and there, which our napkins are going to be um, the baby blue that you see from the tree. So that's going to tie it all together. Our... Um, I forgot what these plates are called. Charger plates. There you go. Our charger plates are that pretty sparkly silver because you want that sparkly aesthetic. And then I was trying to see if anything would actually nestle on top of the fur, but because the fur is so fluffy, I had to kind of nestle everything around it. So it worked out in, in the end for me. And then we also tried a different design with the plates. So typically circular charger plates go with circular plates. But I wanted to use my square plates, so I just made them into kind of a diamond shape where you get hints of silver. And then the plates are in a nice diamond to make everything just really just tie together. And then I actually reused our gold goblets or glasses um, with that gold trim because that would introduce the gold aesthetic to the table because I had some two gold pieces that I wanted to be able to add to the table and I needed a way to introduce them. Another reason why I wanted to use gold is because I had no absolute thing in my mind that said I was going to change the curtains in that room. And the curtains are actually gold and white, but kind of sheer. So I needed to have some gold in that room to tie it all into one because a lot of the accent in that room is gold. So this is what I did. Um, we loved it. It's super cute to us. It might not be your cup of tea, but I absolutely loved the way it came out. And now we're just waiting on the blue napkins to come from Amazon. But that was our Christmas decor this year. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. Hey, hey, hey. Crystal here from Crystal W Online. Just wanted to stop by and let you guys know that we have our limited edition Lapeer gift sets. These are very limited edition. Why? Because it comes with two items that we don't actually stock in the actual store on the regular. So for these gift sets, you'll receive one of our very popular fragrances of choice and then of course you will also get the eight ounce shower gel and also the four ounce body lotion of all matching scent now these come in a gold sachet bag as well as with a to and from tag that way you are able to go ahead and put it right under the tree or gift it to your friends and family you guys check us out crystalwonline.com <laughs>